हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स आई वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन पढ़ाई से दोस्तों यूट्यूब चैनल इन टूडेज वीडियो सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द जियो इन्फॉर्मेटिक्स द टर्म जियो इन्फॉर्मेटिक्स मेनी स्टूडेंट एंड मेनी फ्रेंड्स आस्क मी अबाउट दिस पर्टिकुलर टर्म वॉट इट इज एग्जैक्टली एंड वॉट इज द फ्यूचर अपॉर्चुनिटीज रिलेटेड टू दिस पर्टिकुलर फील्ड ओके सो लेट्स हैव सम ब्रीफ इंट्रोडक्शन अबाउट दिस जियो इन्फॉर्मेटिक्स वॉट इट इज एग्जैक्टली वॉट इज इन्वॉल्व ओके वॉट आर द फ्यूचर प्रॉस्पेक्ट ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर फील्ड ओके सो लेट्स डिस्कस ऑल दिस थिंग्स ओवर इयर सो लेट्स बिगिन बिफोर वी स्टार्ट जस्ट ऑब्जर्व दिस टू फिगर्स यूर यू कैन एबल टू सी द ग्लोब सम फिजिकल फीचर्स ऑफ अवर ग्लोब एंड द पर्सन इज एनालाइजिंग समथिंग एंड हियर यू कैन एबल टू सी द सैटेलाइट ऑर्बाइटिंग टू अवर अर्थ एंड सैटेलाइट इमेजेस विच वी गेट सो वी कैन एबल टू एक्सट्रैक्ट some layers of different features like this from that particular satellite okay so let it be in your mind you will get your answers related to your queries your doubts in subsequent session so let's see what it is exactly so in layman's language we can say geo informatics is a interdisciplinary branch of science or the art which amalgamate the expertise of different knowledge branches like geography then some programming languages information technology engineering and analytical skill to solve the problems which have a geo special origin so what do you mean by this geo special origin which has a input as a geographical data or location okay or something related to the geography plus informatics okay so geo informatics is in another way we can say that it is a science and technology which develops and uses information science infrastructure to address the problem of geography cartography geo sciences and related branches of science and engineering okay so this is a basic terminology which describe the geo informatics it is a branch of study okay which deals with different field like geography cartography photogrammetry remote sensing geographical information system different softwares it involves okay and it also have a study of surveying okay to understand the geography or the physiography of that particular area properly okay so here you can able to do the masters in this particular field after your graduation in engineering or any technical field which suits this particular branch okay which all are given in subsequent session okay so there is one very famous course master of science in geo informatics in pune also you can able to study in pune university symbiosis institute or uh, bharti university there is uh, one more institute known as indian institute of remote sensing located at dehradun okay so that is also one of the important uh, body which deals with this geo informatics study okay so what is this geo informatics exactly it is amalgamation of geo spatial technology geographical analysis and information science okay so these three expertise when you combine together you will get the new branch of study that is nothing but the geo informatics okay it is a next version of geomatics we can able to see here you can able to see the timeline in 1960s or 70s there is a branch known as gis then it develops as a geomatics what is geomatics here you can able to see it is a amalgamation of geodesy mathematics and engineering okay and when you add informatics into it you will get the geo informatics as a very superior type of branch of study you can able to say okay that is a geo informatics here are different application of geo informatics there are many application you just name it we have it like this branch says okay so here you can able to see some applications like there are different earth observation satellites and its interpretation okay the navigation and communication system management then disaster management environmental impact analysis okay there are different agencies like national green tribunal which which analyzes the different governmental project or the private sector project and their in environmental impact okay so that also involves the study of geo informatics then there are many initiatives or the programs launched by government which uh, related to good governance they also involves the geo informatics then there is a geo tagging and geo coding okay you might have heard this particular terms okay you may have tag your photo which captured by your camera your mobile camera and you might have geo tagged it okay so it is again the application of geo informatics then trade and logistic 
Amazon, Uber, Zomato, Ola, whatever services you are using in your day to day life, they have the role of geoinformatics in their services. Okay, there are many logistic services also, they also use the skills of geoinformatics. Then there are different military applications. Okay, then there are term known as health GIS. There is a monitoring system like Arogya Setu app during this corona pandemic. Okay, so it, it also has some part of geoinformatics or the knowledge of geoinformatics is required to monitor this health information system through health GIS. Okay, different platforms of health GIS. Then there is a climate study and forecasting. In different nations, there are different bodies like Indian Meteorological Department in India, IMD. Okay, and there are many more applications. Okay, it is related to the innovation and the problem statement of particular user. How he deal with that problem by using geoinformatics so there are tremendous application before thanking you i would like to show you some notification over here so here you can able to see the notification for online entrance examination for admission of postgraduate graduate and interdisciplinary courses for academic year 2021 so this is a upcoming academic year and this notification is delivered by Savitri by Phule Pune University so you can able to get this particular notification from uh, their official website unipune.ac.in so it is related to the upcoming academic session so those students who are interested in geoinformatics masters in geoinformatics or postgraduate diploma in geoinformatics they can refer this particular application or notification uh, from the university's uh, official website so you will get the entire details about the geoinformatics course when you can able to apply to this course here you can able to observe the syllabus for the online entrance exam there is an entrance exam to get admission in this msc geoinformatics in pune university so in this exam you have to face the questions based on these four sections okay the first section is quantitative aptitude second one is general awareness about geography geographical information system and environment third one is a reasoning fourth one is the computer basics so in your entrance exam you will have a questions based on these so remember this thing okay guys this is about geoinformatics if you have any doubt do comment in comment section below okay and do like this session share with your friend so they will also get acquainted with this new branch of study geoinformatics they will get idea about new career opportunity okay and do subscribe our youtube channel so you will get the notification of upcoming video session okay so thank you and have a nice day